We'll go with this. You're walking down the beach. I got you. You're on the west. It's it's my favorite beach to go to most of the time. Hoffmaster State Park. Yeah. And I like it because it's pretty easy to get around. There's not a lot going around there. You know, I'll pack my own lunch in the cooler, stay all day. Grand Haven be a little crazy sometimes. So you're at Hoffmaster. You're strutting down the beach, looking for shipwrecks, and your toe hits something. And it's kind of hard. You're like, oh, a seashell. But then you're like, oh, this is a lake. It's fresh water, so it can't be a seashell. And then you're like, oh, you. it's, it's actually a genie bottle. Okay, this is real. And you're, it's kind of dirty because it was old. It probably washed up on shore. It was beat up a little bit. And you're, you're like cleaning it off with the cloth you just have in your pocket. And poof! Yeah. A genie popped out. That was that. Did you hear it? Okay, so that genie pops out. He sings that song from Aladdin and says, thank you for freeing me from that bottle. I was getting claustrophobic. You can choose one of these purses as a reward. So there's two purses you got to choose. Here are the two purses. Purse A has $1,000 today. And if you leave it alone, it gets 200 extra dollars in it magically by Dogecoin every day. Okay. Then purse B. It has a whole penny in it. And that penny, if you leave it in there, it doubles. Because Bitcoin. And then it <laughs> turns into two pennies and then so on. How much money is going to be in there after each purse, after a week, after two weeks, after three weeks, and after 30 days? You and your partner. Let's go. No you can use a calculator. I would. Okay. Oh. All right. So let's look at one week. I think um, the function, using the function for the linear purse, purse A, you guys can follow really well. I got $1,000, and I'm adding 200 to it seven times, correct? Yeah. So that is how much money total? 2400 Okay, that's good. So purse two has a penny, and I double it, and I double it, and I double it. How many times? Seven. Seven. So I'm actually going to choose to write it like this. And this says I'm taking a penny and I'm doubling it seven times. And that penny turns into a whopping $1.28. Buck 28. So if you only get to keep it one week, which perch should you choose? A. Yeah, for sure, man. It's way more money, like almost $2,400 more. Okay. He does it for you. Are you kidding me? Okay. So let's go. Oh. Let's go to number two there. How much money? Two weeks. So I got a thousand dollars, and I'm adding, I'm adding two hundred to it each day for two weeks, which is how many days? Fourteen. Okay, and that's a total of how much money then? Thirty-six hundred. Man, that purse. We getting rich. So let's look at purse B. We got that penny. Thirty-eight. Thirty-eight hundred. Okay, got it. So then purse B, I got my penny just on my desk. Good job. And I'm gonna double it, double it, double it. How many times? Seven. For for two weeks? Fourteen. Fourteen. So I'm gonna I'm gonna double it. I'm gonna multiply by two fourteen times. Seven more So 0. .01. I'm gonna double it fourteen times, and I get a whole one sixty three eighty four. So like still nowhere near purse A, right? But that was a pretty big jump from a buck something. And then it's going to keep doubling and doubling. You think it's going to keep doubling? Absolutely. Yeah, bro. If this purse were a country, it'd be, it'd be Ireland. It'd be what? Ireland. Because it's Dublin. Okay. Number three. We're going to look at three weeks. So purse A, a thousand bucks. I'm getting 200 a day for three weeks, which is how many days? 21. Yeah, because three times seven is 21. 1,000 plus. 200 times 21 21 is 5200 wow so if you're patient you can really get that money up there right oh, dang. so we've got three weeks for purse a let's get three weeks for purse b so for purse b we got a penny and we double it 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 how many times so i'm going to rate it like this 21 21 times so a penny times two 21 times. Oh, baby. Something happened. $971.52. So, at three weeks, which one's better now? 
Absolutely. Prayers B. Which one do you think is going to be better forever now? Yeah, because what happens the next week? 42,000. Uh, you know, yeah, close to 42,000, yeah. No, the ne- well, next well, next day. Yeah, like I said next day. It's doubling each day, so. Last question. 30 days. Let's see. I've got $1,000. I'm adding 200 to it over and over and over for 30 days. How much money we got in that bag? 10 I got seven grand. Okay, purse A seems like a solid choice. Purse B, I got a penny. I'm doubling it 30 times. Hey, does everybody see what I'm writing? How it means times two, times two, times two, if I expand? Okay, so one cent, doubling it 30 times. Holy smokes. Ten million. Seven hundred thirty seven dollars. Wait, seven hundred thirty seven thousand and twenty four cent. That's a lot of dollars. Yeah, but just wait one more day. Twenty million or twenty yeah, twenty two million. And then wait another day, then forty million, eighty million, one hundred and sixty million. Each day it's doubling. Wow. Let's beat Elon Musk at this point. So, three, two, one. Eyes up here. Mouths closed. Remember our listening lesson from Trails the other day? Okay. So, the moral of the story is pick purse. It depends how patient you are. Some people will not be able to last 30 days. I could last 30 days. You could last a whole year. I could last as long as I need. Well, a whole year, that'd be... There would not be resources for a whole year. Let's see. If I put a penny times two in my calculator, I'm doing it right now, two, 365. It says overflow error. My calculator can't... It says overflow Yeah, because once you get to a number huge and you double it, you, I'm, so it couldn't even use scientific notation on here to give it. You'd probably get, you'd probably that's crazy. Let's try. So that's the power of the exponent. That way you'd crash. Hadley and I. Who can tell me which purse is the blue dots? Micah, which one do you think? Uh, the blue dots are the purse too. And how do you know? Um, because you see that they're like pretty constant. Um, like lower, lower along the scale, but then they jump up super suddenly. Yeah, and, and eventually if you're doubling, you double a big number, it gets big, big, right? So the percent increase is big every time, right? If you double something, that's a 100% increase over and over and over. 200 is, is by percentage, not a bigger increase over and over. By percentage is actually a small increase, but it's constant, right? So this one would be linear, 200 per day. This one, double, 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 double. Eventually looks almost, do you think it'll ever be perfectly vertical? No, no. no, it'll look like it, and the increase will be like so huge at some point, it would look like it, but it never would be perfectly vertical, okay? And so the rate of change is changing, is a thing we wanna point out there. I don't think we need to go through the questions, which one's better and when, right? They're the same right here? Same-ish, same-ish. And then B was less here, but more here. We got it. We got it. We don't need to take time on that because we're going to look over the quiz. Uh, lesson summer. We're going to hand it out and we're going to get going. Just, just, have, just do it in your head right now, and then when you get the paper, you can write it down because I think some of us are probably already done, actually.